What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? Y'all already know what time it is. Happy Monday. It's another opportunity to start the week off right, you did. Y'all already know we're going to be victorious this week. We're going to stay self-motivated. We're going to stay self-inspired. We ain't going to let nothing stop us. Facts. Big facts. A lot of times when you're trying to accomplish your goals, and you're actually holding yourself accountable for following through on the commitments that you need in order to achieve those goals, the biggest thing that I found that's challenging and frustrating is patience. Patience, 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 patience. And you hear people say all the time, be patient. Be patient, right? And it's extremely frustrating to do because you'll start saying like, man, I'm making the moves, but if I had a bigger budget, I could do more. And that's really not the case at all. See, the thing that you have to understand is patience isn't an action word. It's not something that you can put on or take off or do or you do what I'm saying? It's, it's not it's not really more so an actionable item that you can do physically. It's really a mindset. Facts. It's a mindset. Patience is a mindset. See, patience is you're doing what you can do on the level that you are. And as long as you're doing those things. If you continue to do those things, consistency is the key. If you continue to do those things, guess what? You will accomplish your goal. Facts. Big facts. So in order to start practicing patience, which is a mindset, you got to start being grateful for what you're doing on the level that you're doing it on. Facts. Chase that bag. Big facts. Facts. So start being appreciative of what you're accomplishing on the level that you are. By doing that, you will continue to be consistent. You will eventually do more. And guess what? You will eventually accomplish your goal. So with that being said, baby, chase that bag. Pow!